okay if I film this oh, yeah, and put please. it on YouTube? Please do. Please, get the gospel of... Get the gospel of... This is what we're doing, we're putting it... The gospel should be free. I think, you know what, I think that we're in the same camp. Actually. You guys are out here spreading good news. Huh. We're out here spreading good news and yeah. good vibes too. Yeah. See? You know, if you guys are... are God's message to you. Some love, yeah. you know? God's language works in, in many different ways, mysterious ways. Yeah. Sometimes it's paint on flesh yeah. is an expression of God's love for us. Right. Right? Right. And sometimes people just walking and handing out these things, spreading your guys' light, right. is, is, is proof of God's love. And I have a little message. Yeah. Jesus came into Galilee preaching the gospel of the kingdom of God and saying, the time is fulfilled and the kingdom of God is near. Repent and believe the gospel. And that's what we're doing. We're coming down Hennepin and Minneapolis telling people to repent and turn from their sins or we will all perish in our sins. Now what you need is a donkey. Because Jesus rode into, rode into Galilee on a donkey. Yeah, man. So you need a donkey. That'll, that'll get some attention too. Well, thanks you guys. It's really nice talking to you. Alright? Remember, it's never too late to repent. Well, you know, you know who resided on Mount Sinai? Do you know where the word sin comes from? Are you familiar with that? Where the, where the term sin actually comes from? It was from Mount Sinai. You know where Mount Sinai was, right? Moses met who? No, because sin is an English Right, he word. met Yahweh. He met the burning bush on Mount Sinai. No, but and sin is an English word. Right? You didn't. Those are two different stories. Would you like some free music? What happened? Actually, my name is Narelle, and I'm with XTV, so I would like to, what is your name? My name is Adam. Adam? Adam, and your name is? My name is Ray. Ray, nice yeah. to meet you. Well, that's, isn't that where Yahweh, isn't that where Yahweh's abode was? Was in the mountain of Sinai, in Mount Sinai? Yeah. That's where, that's where Moses received the Ten Commandments. Okay, well, they're in a dispute. What are you guys doing here again tonight, just to recap? Spreading the good news. Spreading the good news. Either way, it's saying that we all need the cross. These are all really old we, I know people wear crosses around their neck, and people wear big, huge crosses. I have a Mother Mary around my neck. But I'm saying that the cross, the cross is still working on people's lives today. Okay. That Jesus died on the cross, yeah, knowing that Christ having been raised from the dead dies no more, death no longer has dominion over him. For the death that he died, he died to sin once for all, but the life that he lives, he lives to God. He himself bore our sins in his body on the cross so we can be dead to sin and live to righteousness. It's all about the cross and Americans need to turn back to the cross instead of back to the sins and the temptations of the world. It's very like you're debating semantics, you're debating ideas. Thank you very much. You guys have a good night now.